creep is the tendency of a material to change form over time, after facing high temperature and stress. Creep increases with temperature, and it is more common when a material is exposed to high temperature for a long time, or at the melting point of the material. A creep test, measures the progressive rate of deformation of a material at high temperature. It is conducted using a tensile specimen, to which a constant stress is applied at a constant temperature, often by the simple method of suspending weight from it. Engineers use creep machine, to determine the stability and behaviors of a material when put through ordinary stresses. Researchers, also test objects with a creep machine to understand the process of metallurgy, and the physical mechanical properties of a metal test the development alloys, receive data from the loads that are derived, and to find out whether a sample or material is within the boundary of what they are testing. The main type of creep testing machine is a constant load creep testing machine. The constant load creep machine consists of a loading platform, foundation, fixture devices and furnace. The fixture devices are grips and pull rods. Loading platform or loading hanger is where the object will endure pressure at a constant rate. Grips hold the material in a certain position. Position is important because if the alignment is off, the machine will deliver an accurate creep reading. Dial gauge is used to measure the strain. It is the object that captures the movements of the object in the machines. The load beam transfers the movement from the grips to the dial gauge. Heating chamber is what surrounds the object and maintain the temperature. General procedure for creep testing are the unloaded specimen is first heated to the required temperature, and the gauge length is measured. The predetermined load is applied quickly without shock. Measurement of the extension are observed at frequent interval. Average of about 50 readings should be taken. Creep graph. Creep is dependent on time, so the curve that the machine generates is a time against strain graph. The slope of a creep curve is the creep rate. The trend of the curve is an upward slope. The graph are important to learn the trends of the alloys or material used, and by the production of the creep time graph, it is easier to determine the better material for a specific applications. There are three stages of creep. Primary creep, starts at a rapid rate, and slows with time. Secondary creep, has a relatively uniform rate. Tertiary creep, has an accelerated creep rate, and terminates when the material breaks or ruptures. It is associated with both necking and formation of grain boundary voids. Characteristics of creep. Creep in service is usually affected by changing conditions of loading and temperature. The number of possible stress temperature time combination is infinite. The creep mechanism is often different between metals, plastics, rubber and concrete.